Hey guys, what is going on here? Welcome back to the channel here. We have got another little battle of Scarlet and Violet 151. We have got two Elite Trainer boxes and three booster bundles. This equals a booster box worth of packs. So we have 18 packs versus 18 packs. See, which is kind of like the better value to get for what kind of hits you get out of 18 packs each. We'll go ahead and start with the Elite Trainer Box. We got a Magikarp, Grimer, Vileplume. I'll just be probably skimmed through a lot of, ooh, we got an upside down card. Pidgeot, Ditto, and a Machamp. I'll probably be skipping through most of the commons and uncommons. Sure, everybody has seen most of them before. We got a Snorlax, Poliwag, and we got a Ninetales, EX, and a Dark Hollow Energy. A Weeping Bell, ooh, Victory Bell, I do need that for my Master Set. Articuno. Still after my number one chase card, which is the... Which is the uh, Venus Art Special Illustration Rare. Knowing my luck, I pull all the other ones first. Got a Farfetch'd, Bellsprout, and an Electrode with that dope fire energy. That was an unexpe uh, unexpected surprise with the energies. I really like how they put those in there like that. Marowak. They actually look really cool. A lot of them have multiple swirls in them. We got a Bulbasaur, Weezing, and a Dragonite Hollow. Light here on the hits so far. Oh, we got something good in this one. We got a Tentacruel. Ooh, and a Giovanni's Charisma. With a Jolteon. Super off center though. Wow, that top is way off top to bottom. That's crazy. Seeing that quality is not too good with this set. Get a lot of off-center cards. But that is definitely a card that I needed, so that is pretty dope right there. We've got a Bulbasaur, Cedra, and a Jinx, and a Psychic Energy. Abra Reverse, Ghastly, oh, I do need that one as well, and a Ditto. I always try to get one of every Reverse for the sets, if I can. Zubat, Paris, oh, I need that Paris as well. And a Dragonite. Got a Daisy's Help, Poliwag, I think I need that one as well. Ooh, and a Full Art Arbok. Super vibrant colors on this guy, very nice. Vulpix, Victory Bell, and a Kabutops. Oh, we got something in here. Come on. I hope it's the... I'm not even going to say it. Come on. Come on. Got a War Total. Oh, Blastoise EX. Special Illustration Rare. With a Beedrill and a 
Steel Energy. This Blastoise card is dope. It's definitely the second best one in the set. Venusaur is the best. This is the second best. And the Charizard is last. Not the best artwork for the Charizard. So far, that's two special illustration rares with the uh, ETBs. Pidgey, Bellsprout, Doduo, Dodrio, I mean. It's going to be kind of hard for the booster bundles to compete with that. And I've had some I Need That One. That's very nice. We've got a Kangaskhan. I've had pretty bad luck with booster bundles as well. Like, I've been getting, like, one hit or even sometimes no hits out of an entire booster bundle. Maybe today our luck will change. We got a Ponita, Weezing, and a Machamp with another Fire Energy. All right, saved you guys the hassle. I did pre-open these. Just put that back in there and save it for later. So we ended up with six hits. One full art and two special illustration rares for the ETBs. Let's see what these booster bundles can do. We got an Amistar. Ooh, a War Turtle and a Dragonite. That one's super off center too with a lot of print lines. Jeez, that is just terrible. Go ahead and smooth these ones over. I'm pretty sure that I need that war turtle. I hope I do. We got a Hitmonchan, Execute, and a Mr. Mime. Farfetched, Nidorina, Chansey. Got an Arcanine, Gengar, and an Electrode with a Water Hollow. Got a Bell Sprout that looks like it's gonna be a Jinx Shelder and a Jinx EX. Oh my gosh, I think I already have like four or five of these. This is definitely like one of the most common full arts. Looks like we got two hits for this booster bundle. That's all I expect. They don't really ever give me more than that. Maybe I could get a cracked out one here though. And set that aside for later. I mean, if I get two hits out of each one, that'll match the ETBs, like, exactly so. Ooh, Venus REX, very nice. And nothing over there. Got a Butterfree. Ooh, an Ammonite and a Vileplume. This Ammonite looks pretty dope. We got two hits pretty early on in this one. Maybe we could uh, get some extra hits in this box. Come on now. Goldeen, Kabuto, and a Flareon. Parasect, a Nidoran, and a Dodrio. Watch, we strike out of these last four packs just because we already got the two hits. 
Hitmonchan, Charmeleon, and a Starmie. Come on, come on. Farfetched, Diglett, and a Kabutops. See, come on. Had all the opportunity in the world to get more than two hits in that one, and it just could not. And our last booster bundle here. Got a Hitmonchan, a Weedle, and a Starmie. Gonna need some good fools to beat the Elite Trainer boxes, that's for sure. We got two special illustration rares over there. Got a Farfetch'd Leftovers, Chansey, and a Steel Hollow. Arcanine, ooh, Caterpie, and an Alakazam. Ooh, we got a double banger. You actually don't get that too often in this set. This Caterpie is really cool. So now we are at six hits for both. With three packs left. We got a Bulbasaur, Aerodactyl. I just love that Aerodactyl. I mean, look at that artwork. It's so cool. Same thing with that Vaporeon. Super nice. A lot of the hollows in the set actually are like really nice looking. Got a Machop, Poliwag. Ooh, and an Arbok with a Dark Energy. We get three hits out of that box. Wow. And a Dodrio, Victory Bell, and a Vile Plume. Well, we ended up with seven hits with the booster bundles and six hits with the ETBs, but the ETBs did have two special illustration rares. Obviously, those two are much better than anything on the other side, but I don't know which one do you guys think are better? I actually think the ETBs are usually better, and I think they do end up giving you better pools, but that could just be, you know, my luck. Let me know what you guys think, and I'll see you guys in the next one.